Snyder. Those are the 13 scheduled, but I think we have 10 down there we counted. Oh, we have 11 now? Four, seven, I think we have 11 on there. So we'll sort them all out when they come around. Well, the clock will sort them out for us. Where are we going to get a time? They're not running. Walk gum right to the lead? Come on, that's not even the style. Huh. <laughs> oh. With her fluorescent pink headband. So, Dom, uh, when we were here for uh, Bishop Laughlin, but Machia won twice, so, and Waddington's very good. So, this is a, and of course, Lola Denise, so we got a lot of talent. Yeah, they do run the two mile at nationals. Most places will run the 3200. So it's hard to get some times up for the, the and of two mile. In the 3, 000, so. Yep. So you can see on your screen there who the, the top seeds are, but it's still Ava leading. With Maki and Deneen. Now Deneen and Machia. Well, Ava also knows she, she's got to push the pace because uh, I think Zario has the uh, well, there, there's, a little bit more of a sprint. There's so few two mile races so far this year that Ava's time of 11.04 is listed as US number one, but you know, you want to compare well, that. Well, the 3200, you're going to uh, about a 1036. So two miles is going to be longer. So maybe 10. They, they do the conversion. They do okay. The on, uh, uh, so if we get down into around the 1036 range, that would be the equivalent, or much faster actually, of the top time in the country for the, the 32. Well, yeah, I mean, it was a good, uh, um, 245. Um, the game, we had Higgins from Shaker, uh, pushing the kids, and I think that was the two dollars, and, uh, and of course, Molo was pushing, uh, Dario. Well, they're on 11, 11 flat pace right now, and they're running in around 42 seconds for their laps. So we'll see if anybody wants to go a little faster than 11 minute pace. Still. A little faster until like halfway through the race. So. Gum and Deneen, so we expect him to come around at you know sub five and a half minutes or at five and a half minutes if they're 11 minute pace. A couple more laps to go before we see that. <laughs> look, how, look how wide they're going there, some of the girls already in a two mile. Yeah, but the pace isn't that fast, so. Also, Zario already took a spill. I think it was with the no, She's going wide here. She got the long stride. She wants to stay out of trouble. And she's running a little bit extra. She's the one in the green who's out wide. See, there's three abreast there with Gum, Deneen, and Machia. So someone's going to have to tuck in here. It's not a great strategy to be running outside for, for the race it adds distance yeah but when you go to the straightaway it doesn't matter anymore let's see if machia will cut in
So you saw the split was right on 11 minute pace, 449.72. So, what about a little slower than 11 minutes? Excuse me. So it's 11, 11 to 8, 11 9, somewhere around there. So it's quite slow. I'm sorry, I'm not, I'm not, this is the mile, five, you know, 530, yeah, it's still 11, it's still 11, so it's still doing 40, yeah, 41, 4, 41 and a half, so let's see if they, somebody decides to go for it here, we're at 11 minute pace. And Maki is still running wide, even on the turns. Well, again, she has a, despite being a freshman, she's a very tall frame and long legs, and you, she took a spill already, so she's just trying to stay on top. So we still, we have a pack of really six girls who are all together. This is, this is become somewhat of a tactical race, I guess. It's, and it's very encouraging to see all six of them at 11 minute pace, because you expect if the pace gets a little bit faster, we can get six girls under 11. That'd be nice. And I'm guessing that Ava Gunn is. So you're predicting. So they've been doing 41. 41.45, 41 this, 41.82, 41, 41. So they're all been sub 42, but they're in the high 41. So we can check to see. She looks like she might be picking it up a little bit here. Let's see, we're still 41.57. So they're all really consistent. Well, we'll call it 41 highs the whole time. I think they're all sitting on Ava at this point and it kind of took the pace. Well, we we know Maki's got a sprint. And she's now going into second, finally. Looked like she wants to take the lead, finally. Nope, but she's now in second. Well, if it comes down to a sprint, Dario probably has the uh, advantage there. So then we see her in the thousand, I think, or something. So. And it's Gavin Makia. We talk about many times, sometimes it's an advantage just to hang in there and on the, someone on the leader's back shoulder and just let them drag you along. But now we have four girls who are in the lead pack. Gamakia, Hausman, and Deneen. So Gum Machia and Houseman and then Deneen falling a little bit off the pace here. So it's really the three. Lindsay Hausman from Kent Place has a 10.46 seed time, which is quite impressive. They put down Machia's seed time as 10.25, which is crazy fast. If that's for freshmen, that's crazy fast. I don't know where that came from, but... Well, 10.25 is flying for, I mean, it's hard for girls to run, say, 5, 12 and a half from just a mile, let alone 10.25 for two miles. We've had girls go sub 10. A few have gone sub 10 for the two mile. Remember Hannah DeBalzi back in the day did sub 10 as a sophomore. So it looks like, well, I have to say, I can't really tell who wants the lead here. It's just been Maki on the outside, Gum on the inside, and Houseman just kind of like all alone by herself now, just kind of watching those two. Perhaps, I don't know what kind of sprint speed she has. She's just trying to hang in there.
So we're getting ready for the bell lap. Does anybody want to make a concerted move here? I don't know. Here we go. Well, who comes Houseman? She looks like she's been hanging there and now Makia is still in second. Don't want to get tangled up there. I don't know. Yeah, she's trying. Houseman doesn't want to let her go. Houseman and Makia, and they're in a dead sprint now. We'll see who's got the sprint. Houseman on the inside, Makia on the outside. We know Makia's got great speed, and it looks like it'll be Zariel Makia. Oh my goodness, for the freshman. 10.49.79, so they really picked it up in those last laps, wow. Just itching out, Houseman. Lindsay Houseman and Ava Gum third. Well, that was a marquee race for sure. It looked tactical, but uh, ended up being quite fast. Right. right. So, so we got three under 11. That's quite impressive. impressive in one race to have three girls under 11. As we said, the top times in the country was only 11, was like an 11 minutes. 